Ooh. Feel like I'm in the third inning. <laughs> nice and hot, sweaty. Roger Clemens was in contention for the world amateur title. Just one shot off the lead on the back nine, the Rocket would find the Woods out of bounds on this tee shot on the par 5 sixth. Following the penalty, he nearly holed out for bogey, but had to settle for a seven. Then on the par 4 eighth, he sinks this par putt. When it was all said and done, the eight handicap shoots a 79 for a net 71 to finish in a tie for ninth overall in the nearly 3,100 player field. Golf is just fun. I mean, uh, you know, it's, you know, I don't practice enough at golf, so it's always challenging for me. And uh, so, you know, I love to do it. And, um, you know, it was with a uh, good group of guys, and I think everybody had a great time. Following the round, the focus was on baseball. The 50 year old will pitch next Friday for the Independent League Sugarland Skeeters, with rumors of a return to the big leagues being bandied about. No, we've got something fun planned, but we just uh, we don't know if it's going to be able to happen or not, so we'll wait and see next week if it all works out. Can you get yeah. more into detail about something fun planned? I, I, I'm not going to uh, elaborate on that. There, okay. There's been speculation since, since you've been here this week of a possible two-start run with the Astros. What's your yeah. reaction to that? Yeah, well, I haven't, I haven't heard that. Hold on one second. <laughs> Billy B, see you. Thanks, buddy. Yeah, yeah I, can't, I can't control the speculation, so I, I'm, not, I'm too concerned with it. While his baseball future is still a mystery, Clemens enjoyed his week on the Grand Strand, including a visit to Coastal Carolina to play the Hackler course. My uh, playing partner and I, J Jim West, and I walked, went by the university there, uh, awesome little uh, football field and uh, baseball facility. I saw the covered uh, area. So uh, I, if I have it right, this is a singing, fighting rooster. I, my, grandfather, my grandfather called me Rooster Peck, and we had roosters. My grandmother and mother loved, that, loved, loved the rooster, so uh, it brought me a little luck today. Even though I wasn't able to finish, uh, it still brought me some luck today. I was able to hit some good shots, good trouble shots to get, to get myself back into play.